More than six feet of snowfall in Western Europe prompted local authorities on Sunday to further restrict traffic and force airlines to cancel flights in the Buffalo area just a hit for a busy Thanksgiving holiday week. New York girl Katie Hochul called in the National Guard, sending about 115 people to hell with snow removal and meet the needs for residents in the hardest hit part of the area county. In a press conference in the afternoon, Hochul said that she would send a request for a federal emergency declaration to seek rem- Investments for the cost of responding to the storm. Euro County exclusive Mark Polanskats said most residents needed the driver ban and stay at home, which he believes prevented tragedies. We have avoided many incidents and accidents, which unfortunately claimed lives in the past. Blizzards hit West New York, limited travel a hit for Thanksgiving. Area country which has felt the brunt of the snowfall recorded a total 77 inches in Orchard Park, New York, home of the Buffalo Bills in Hill home field. Flores began blowing of Lake Erie and Ontario on Tuesday. triggering the first major snowstorm of the season more than a month before the start of winter. Conditions cloud last until Monday morning, according to the National Weather Service. About 19 crashes have been reported and nearly 219 people have been rescued from the roads, Hoshi said. We have several abandoned cars, she said. They are being dead with by the scale is far from where we are seeing the storm in the past. In Hamburg, New York, more than 74 inches of snow fell during the weekend blizzard, with many residents of the Waterfalls Village Mobile Home Park covered in snow. It's scary I have been still in my house for three days now, said Bob Howard, a 23 year Mobile Home Park resident. Howard said he has never seen such a strong storm before and he is worried about his elderly neighbors. I feel bad because all the older people are counting on me got out there and I can't get out, Howard said. People are asked to take precautions before leaving the house. Several northern countries, including Cuyahoga Lake, Gurga, and Ashtabula counties, were under a snowfall warning due to lake effect, according to the National Weather Service. The Ohio Department of Transportation has reported numerous crashes and slowdowns in and out of the Cleveland area, especially on I-19 east due to slippery weather. Ribbons of snow have made their way into northeast Ohio, causing conditions and multiple traffic incidents throughout the region. A snow emergency have been killed in Ashtabula country as the first winter storm hit northeast Ohio. The National Weather Service, which issued a, a weather warning early Friday, also said when the weather is expected as gets cold reach 45 million hours. Traveling can be very difficult, the National Weather Service said. A non-uniform blizzard can significantly impair visibility. Snow is expected to move ash hole from the lake. <coughs> However, on a much larger scale, the people on Buffalo New York are bracing for a massive sandstorm that cloud hit several feet. After several hours of snowballing, A snow flurry in a short but intense period of heavy snowfall, according to NVS. The snow builds up to 2 inches in less than 30 minutes. There are also strong winds that can reach over 30 mph, as well as without conditions that reduce visibility by less than a quarter of a mile. Heavy snowfall will continue to accumulate in western New York after the historic storm raw record snowfall in the Buffalo area, totally over 6 feet in some areas. Much of the country has seen a significant cooling trend since last week. 
With some areas experiencing the first measurable snow of the season this week, the slow pressure snow forming system which will slide through the Midwest of the Northeast drivers advised to follow snow squalls warning during snow squalls every this week. Snow squalls usually happen when it's partly cloud outside and they can start suddenly catching drivers off ground. This sudden snow fury can lead no major traffic incidents, including total multi vehicles crashes. The National Weather Service is issuing snow squalls warning to warn of the sudden onset of flight theatering conditions experienced by high wide trails during snow squalls.